guys, welcome back to the canteen. It's Stephanie here, friendly neighborhood bartender. Please remember you haven't subscribed. Subscribe, hit that bell so you know when I upload more content. Like, hit those likes because the more likes I get, the more my video gets seen and you get notifications. And share away here, we share away here for little Star Wars. And I hope you enjoy the upcoming video. Well, we're back here, uh, cantina dwellers. Welcome back to the cantina. Pull up a bar stool, pull up a chair, order a drink, whatever you want, food. As we all know, yesterday was Father's Day. And while a lot of us were thinking thoughts about how much we love our dads, and in my case, how much I miss my dad, a lot of you feel the same way who don't have your dads with you anymore. Uh, we have people who like to shit on this holiday and shit on people in general for whatever psychological fucked up reason they have. Case in point, Paolo Hidalgo, the man who should have been fired from Star Wars or Lucasfilm last year. In fact, if I remember right, last year we all thought he was fired. All right, do y'all remember that? Everybody in the Phantom Menace, gather around. You saw it going on. Why the f is he still there and why is his wife there? So yesterday, <clears throat> Pablo does it again. Trolling the fans. Why? Because he's a bully and a jackass. Here's what he did. You guys saw the, the, the two tweets. The first one was, Happy Father's Day with uh, that horrible, disgusting, vile, really upsetting and disturbing picture from The Force Awakens. Han Solo. Oh, we all know what I'm talking about. You saw the tweet. Second one, he's mocking a fan who took umbrage at it. Basically saying he was joking, implying that he was... It, Whatever. And then you had <clears throat> people trying to defend him, saying the tweet was fake. Well, first off, the tweet isn't fake. He posted it. Okay. You know, I'm sure he's wandering around saying, they fake that. They fake that. Look, there is a Pablo Hidalgo parody account. But you know it's a parody account. No one has a Pablo Hidalgo fake account that pretends to be Pablo. He posted it. There it is. Why? Because he's a bully, he's an insecure fat ass, because he's a political uh, terrorist, he's a cultural terrorist, he gets to do whatever he wants. Now, I have been told, we have been told, I was told this in private, that his job is safe. Are you kidding me? Part of the reason why uh, Disney Star Wars is in the shit right now is because of people like him. He is the main culprit. Again, baiting fans to that picture, knowing he pissed people off. Baiting fans then and mocking fans when they call him out for it. It is unprofessional, adolescent bullshit. Why is he still at Lucasfilm? Who did he talk to? Um, if George is back doing more than just consulting, did he talk his way back into George's good graces? How? How? The proof is right there. I want to know why a guy who tweets pictures of drawings that he's done of Transformers all goddamn day long and talks shit all day long on Twitter is still working at Lucasfilm. I want to know why this apathetic, angry guy who spends all day mocking people on Twitter and rolling in the shit with the rest of the garbage. Still has a job at Lucasfilm. Shouldn't he be doing his job? But this is just the latest outrage. You know, it's, it's basically, you know, along with all the 
ageist crap that the that the uh, losers at Lucasfilm like to put out there against against the OT actors. Um, how short sighted they are because they don't understand that people will crawl over broken glass to see a movie with them in it, playing their original characters. We wouldn't spend five seconds with Ray or Kyle Ron, and they know it. And the reason why they behave the way they are and they're so defensive is because they're getting called out for it. They know they've been called out and they know they're in trouble. So hey, this is Steph. Wondering again why Pablo Hidalgo is still at Lucasfilm. I mean, it is beyond the beyond. He, he doesn't get it. You're not part of the club. You never were. You know? You, uh, I mean, what are we supposed to do? Okay? Like the shit you're serving us? You lazy, apathetic, fat ass? Sorry, I don't play that game. And you wouldn't work for me. You'd have been fired a long time ago. Stuff to think about, Pablo, because I'll tell you something. You might think your job is safe, but it's not. Steph, signing out. See you around the galaxy. See you around the cantina. Please remember to tip those wookie bartenders 20%. And no fights in the cantina. No gunfights. You take that shit outside. No droids. No bounty hunters. No railos. See you around the galaxy. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. Please remember, if you haven't subscribed, subscribe. Hit that bell so you know when I upload more content. Hit those, those like buttons again. Remember, if you hit the like button, you'll get notifications. And then I won't be getting people like I'm not getting notifications. Also, please remember to share away here. We share away here for love Star Wars. And upcoming video will likely be reading Raylo with stuff. Enjoy. I'll see you later, guys. See you around the galaxy. Let's go. Thank you.